Welcome back to Google Guru. Today I'm going to show you how to transfer ownership of Google Docs. Now there's a few ways that you can do it, and the first way is obviously at the user level. So I'm going to go into Drive, and then from here I don't even actually have to open a document. I can just click on the checkbox to the left, and then click the share button here at the top of the screen, enter in the name of someone that I would like to share it with, click share and save. And then I just need to go to this drop down menu right here and change it to is owner. And that automatically changes my access to can edit. I can also change this to comment and view. So Albert Einstein will have full control over this document. You can also transfer ownership of folders as well as multiple documents at a time. So I'm just going to go into my drive, open up a folder, select all, and then go through the exact same process. Add Albert Einstein, then change the status to is owner. And then when you're done, just click save changes. I'm not going to do that right now because I kind of want to hold on to these documents. So that's transferring ownership when you yourself want to give someone else ownership of a document. But let's say you don't really have the permission of the user or you're an admin and you need to go in and delegate ownership of a document or several documents on your own. So there's two ways to do this. The first way, which allows you to transfer ownership of a user's entire drive, is through the control panel. So you access the control panel by clicking on the gear right here, and then manage, then go down to settings over by drive and docs, then over here to tools. From here, all you have to do is enter in the email address of the person that you would like to transfer the documents away from, to whomever you would like to give the documents to. So by doing this, all the documents previously owned by Albert Einstein were transferred into my possession. Now this only allows me to transfer all of the documents, but let's say I want to transfer one document or several documents or a couple folders of documents. Now the only way to do that is with the third party tool. So I'm going to show you how to do this using Flash Panel. So to access Flash Panel, I'll click on the more drop down right here at the top of the screen and scroll down to Flash Panel. I'll go up here to Drive. And then I'll just click on this text box right here, where I can actually filter by a number of things. So I'm going to filter by owned by user and enter in an email address. So I'll choose Larry. And I can see all the documents that this user currently owns. I can scroll through these and select a few. And then click here on edit permissions, change owner, and then transfer the ownership of those documents to myself. I can notify the new owner about the change in ownership via email, and I can also change the previous owner's status to editor, viewer, or remove them completely. So I'll just leave them as a viewer and click update. So that's how you can transfer ownership of Google Docs. Obviously there's more than one way to do it, but I think Flash Panel offers a lot of flexibility as a domain management tool that does a lot of things that the control panel can't. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you have any questions please leave us a comment in the section below. Thanks.